joined by Tennessee golf coach Brennan Webb, Tennessee, fresh off a 600 par round down in Cabo, uh, setting now seventh at the uh, kind of the uh, two thirds point of this three day event. Um, you technically moved down a couple of spots. You were fifth yesterday, but a better day today uh, there at Cabo del Sol. Yeah, it was, um, you know, Hunter was out of it early. That's uh, always a stressful day for a coach when you're uh, need four guys to count and one's out, you know, an hour into the day, basically, um, with some big numbers that he made. So to, uh, to escape, I guess, for lack of a better word, with, with the six under was, uh, you know, it's encouraging. When you look at, you know, what Tyler Johnson got done today, how big was that for his confidence? Um, you know, four under, 67, uh, just kind of what were the key parts in his round? Yeah, I mean, he, he's been hitting the ball really, really well, struggling a little bit with his putting, um, but just made a couple putts today, hit the ball great, uh, made a couple sloppy bogeys there on one and two towards the end of his round, but battled back and buried his last hole and um, really saved the day for us with that four under for sure. When you talk to your team when you're on the course, and I know you you know you're, you might be with one guy and Bo may be with another, and you're, that's who you see all day. When when somebody goes down like Hunter does, do you have to adjust and maybe get around to the other guys and say, "Look, <laughs> you're counting today. You got to hang in there." Yeah, no, we don't talk about that during the rounds. You know, they're out there trying to play the best they're going to play, regardless sure. of what's going on. So, um, you know, it was actually beneficial with Hunter being uh, our number one player today, playing last. It was no one that was watching him struggle, and you know, maybe some thoughts creep into their own mind about what's going on behind them. So. Um, you know, obviously it's tough, but we'll uh, get, get to work on the range here and, and get to figure out something for tomorrow. What, what, what's the goal? What's the mindset going into round three? You know, what, what, what kind of words of wisdom do you give the team at this point? Yeah, I mean, it's not much that you can do at this stage. We're going to, you know, just clean up some things on the range. And, you know, we're, we're capable of shooting a, a 10 or a 12, 14 under tomorrow. Who knows? If it's our day, it's our day. So we're going to go out and um, be ready to go, have a good game plan and, Hopefully get off to a good start and finish it off. You're pretty bunched right there. You know, how important will the start be tomorrow to try to get off to that, you know, to try to shoot one of those low double-digit under par rounds? Yeah, I think the start tomorrow will be um, very uh, important. We'll just um, hopefully get get in the flow of the game. The rotation that we're on, we finish with some par fives tomorrow. Um, so hopefully, you know, get off to a good start and finish it off. Good luck in round three, all right? Thanks, JP.